Welcome, everybody, as usual and stuff. This is the Courtney Cox cast. All right, yeah. Courtney Cox talk. I am your host, Dean Bowling. I have with me Jared Williams. Hey, how's it going? Jared Williams. Um, today, this is a new thing. We're, we're it's, it's somewhat similar, but not really to the video game stack. Uh... And that series, what we mostly focused on was playing video games and talking about them. And this series, it's a little, a little different, not really. It's uh, really focused on talking about the life and times of Courtney Cox. Great, great American actress. Just slightly different. Still, I, I think we'll pull in the same audience, though, with these two um, ventures, I guess you could say. We're looking at you, Iowa. Um... So yeah, where to begin? Courtney Cox. Uh, Great place to start. To to really fully understand Courtney Cox, you should probably look at her Wikipedia page, which is not locked, so anybody can edit. I, actually, this is a terrible place to find out about Courtney Cox. Uh, let's let's look somewhere else. Um, what one thing we'll do though for the Courtney Cox cast is look at recent news and views of Courtney Cox. Of course. Uh, I have a, a news, I guess you could call it news, a news story uh, up here. It's from dailymail.co.uk. Courtney Cox flashes her bra on a daring plunging blouse as she takes her little fairy girl to Halloween lunch. Now, one thing we got to notice here, Dean, is she didn't all purposefully flash her bra. It was just a uh, an accident and her uh, one of her buttons might have been buttoned but it was just a wardrobe malfunction if you will. I I will fully hold up the integrity of Courtney Cox but as a fan and as a unbiased opinion I have to be questioning why she did not button up her blouse that is I I can work a button so I assume that the majestic Courtney Cox can work a button well, as you see the picture on the screen right now, she is on her phone. She looks kind of distressed. And, and her, and her, and the, she kind of looks like E.T. in this she, picture. A little bit like E.T. She's going to I, pick um, up her daughter, can, I think. Can we get the video, guys? Can we put this picture yeah, up? The, yeah, the picture will put be up. Put this picture up yeah, right up. now. All okay. right. Yeah, that's a picture of Courtney uh, Cox looking like E.T. And uh, if you, we look to the, the next picture, she is with her daughter. You'll see that on screen right about uh, her, now. Her, do her daughter is supposed to be a fairy princess. I think is that is that it? I'm I'm a little fairy girl, and uh, it's it's really just a girl with a tutu. I'm on. just not seeing the uh, looks more like a Beetlejuice kind of thing to me. I'm, yeah, I'm, I, I agree. She has a black I'm, and white I'm stripe not, towards not seeing skirt. the fairy princess thing. I don't as I I I'm not one to question the integrity of Courtney Cox. She is obviously my idol. She's who I want to be when I'm older. But with the wardrobe malfunction. And just her terrible excuse of a daughter's outfit for Halloween. I mean, Courtney Cox is probably net worth like $4 billion by now. And, um, yeah. So I really question why she can't get a good enough, you know, or a good enough outfit for her daughter. And, uh, we, so we have a surprise guest right now who just walked in the room, Mr. Uh, Zane. How you doing, Zane? Say hi to the audience. What's up? He's, uh, Zane is a football player for the University of Kentucky. He's a big dude, and he, uh, loves football. Yeah. Anything you want to tell us about yourself, Zane? From Lexington. How are y'all tonight? All right, moving on. We're gonna, we're gonna talk about Courtney Cox's most recent venture, uh, Cougar Town. Cougar Town is a new, not new, it's not new at all, it's, it will be uh, in its fourth season, uh, is premiering January uh, 2013, um, Courtney Cox, she stars in that with Mr. Josh Hopkins, uh, I believe the show has been moved to TBS, and that's really all I have right now on that, uh, as more information comes out about Cougar Town and whatnot, we will have that. Moving on to more Courtney Cox stories. Uh, let's see what we got here. Hmm. An another Halloween story. These, these are kind of old. These are Halloween, but never too old for the, the Courtney, Courtney Cox, Cox cast. cast. The Courtney Cox talk. 
here. Uh, I actually, I don't think my uh, internet's really working, so we'll, we'll talk about other stuff. Uh, Courtney Cox talk. Uh, I'm on her website right now. Uh, there's a story here. I don't know how old this is. I don't know how much she keeps up with her website. But I see that there are over 17 hours of special features from the original Friends DVD releases. I don't know where these 17 hours are on. I don't know if there's a new box set out. But they are out there somewhere, so you should get that. Well, for we, all your Courtney Cox needs. we got to think of the hundreds of hours of Friends have actually been recorded. So 17 is is a respectable number, I'd say, for the amount of extras that your audience is given with the box set. I mean, you're saying, I don't know if these uh, extras are structured in any way, but you say an episode's about 20 minutes, you divide 17 hours by 20 minutes, you probably got like a thousand new episodes of Friends right there. Yeah, and it's like, it's like you just found a whole bunch of new Friends. I, it's like they decide to keep that show going. That's... Mm. Well, that's that's. I, I think that's all we got today on Courtney Cox Talk, the Courtney Cox Cast. Yeah, thanks for joining us, and uh, be sure to come back next. We'll time. be back next Wednesday night as we discuss other Courtney Cox things.